Oh, welcome back, everyone, to the Lake Osceola State Bank Post Game Show. Rob Bentley and Sandy Golston with you, joined now by the head coach of the Ferris State Women's Basketball Squad, Kendra Foston, after an 88 to 69 win over Lewis. And coach uh, showed no signs of a of a holiday break right there. Your team came out and uh, and played well here today. Yeah, absolutely. Thanks. I appreciate it. I'm really I'm proud of our group. Uh, and, the, and the effort and the focus that we showed. I thought we played really hard. Um, I think that Lewis is, they, they are really tough. Uh, and, and we, you know, we're, we felt that we played them. Uh, that it was a really physical uh, up and down game. So I'm, I'm proud of our group for, uh, for that, that dig. Maybe talk about the play of Riley Blair in that first half, 28 points uh, overall, and kind of picked up right where she left off against Southern Indiana last weekend. Yeah, absolutely. Um, I mean, what can you say about uh, 12 for 14 from the field and four for four from the three-point line? Um, I mean, she's just she's really, really crafty at finding ways to score and and open opportunities and. Um, Man, she, she just was in his own there. And so we just, you know, what's really great about this group is that um, I, I don't really have to coach much. And, you know, Riley is feeling it and we find, we, our, our group on the floor makes sure that she still gets the ball and finds ways for her to get the ball. And, um, and that's, you know, I think that's a testament to, to our players' uh, experience and an IQ and focus. Um, so, I mean, Riley just, she was on another planet. Obviously, a game like this, uh, a regional game that uh, helps prepare you for the start of conference play coming up later this week. Oh, yeah. Thanks for reminding me conference play, man. We, we, we better be ready for that. Um, yeah, I mean, this is a really good regional opponent, and, um, and we're getting ready to, to start the GLIAC, which is a grind. And, um, and I think that our non-conference schedule you know, prepared us for that. Obviously, you were able to work in a lot of different kids uh, here, and uh, it seemed like in that first half, especially early in the second half, anybody you put out there really uh, was able to contribute and uh, make, made some nice plays for you. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, Shai played 13 minutes, had six assists. I mean, she's just she's really, really making some great decisions with the ball. And, um, you know, Mallory played a lot of minutes at the one and the two. Um, I thought she did a great job. Um, you know, Renee Sturham played major minutes and defensively I mean she's just irreplaceable she's so tough at rebounding the basketball and then I thought again Sam um, Sam Kraus and Savannah Gibson came in and gave us some really great minutes um, you know Sam they both took care of the ball well and uh, you know Savannah and Sam have been a part I'll, I'll say this every time I talk about them Savannah and Sam have been a part of our program uh, they're for this is their third year and they haven't seen a lot of, of minutes on the floor and they stay the course and they keep working they keep growing their game and then today you see them out there uh, getting buckets and rebounds and um, you know it takes those are like the behind the scenes players that you don't hear a lot about they don't score all the points they don't get all the stops or rebounds um, that you don't hear about that are so so essential to our team and our program um, so I'm really I'm really proud of those two Obviously, 5-1, uh, and one, uh, kind of where you want to be right now going into conference play and a tough uh, opening weekend here with uh, Wayne State National coming to town this week. Yeah, absolutely. We better be ready to go. Um, you know, two really good opponents coming in, and the GLIAC's a whole different whole different ball game. And uh, I'm excited for our freshmen to, to see what that means. Um, you know, for them, they, it, that's pretty exciting. They don't know, and, our, and all of our upperclassmen, and in particular our seniors, uh, are really looking forward to conference play. So we'll, uh, we'll be ready or not. It's, it's happening. I can't even believe it was Thanksgiving, let alone now we're, we're rolling into conference play in December. Well, Coach, congratulations again on the win. We'll, we'll talk to you again on Thursday night. Thanks, Rob. I appreciate it.